that was the hardest part was to to um to actually learn how to play the drums not how to look like you're playing the drums netflix's new movie metal lords which is awesome how are you guys doing today good right. Good. Right. awesome uh jayden i want to ask you man were, were you a drummer before this movie or was the, did you have to learn to play for the film no i, I never really touched the drums before um so there was about a, a, a month before filming started where i was i was practice, practicing every day um i really really had to to grind a little bit what what would you say was maybe the the most difficult part about about learning to play drums um i well i mean really it's the the technicality of it all um i feel like what was really drilled in when i was practicing with um my my teacher glenn sobel was was how to look how to look cool and um the amount of intensity to put in and energy um but really what i was more fascinated with and, and what i really wanted to hone in on was the to make it sound good which is not the priority when you're filming a movie but that was the hardest part was to to um to actually learn how to play the drums not how to look like you're playing the drums. <laughs> uh, Isis, I uh, want to ask you, you know, what's it like being, you know, both a cast member and a band member? Do, do you feel like you're one more than the other? I, <laughs> <laughs> more, I don't know. We, we were saying earlier that we were going to go on tour. I think for me, I think I'm more of a cast member just because I didn't play cello before and it, mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like not sort of ingrained into my being. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm a <laughs> Well, uh, okay, Adrian, how about you? Were you a guitarist before? Yeah, I've been playing, I've been playing for, for like 10 years or something like that, um, uh, but not metal. Sure. So that was a fun shift. <laughs> the right hand, the picking hand, that was a whole, my left hand, I, I, that I, I, I was up to speed with that, but the right hand, that is so technical. That is so impressive that people can pick that fast, that articulately. Did you, did you uh, gain any kind of appreciation, any more appreciation for metal music or any metal bands? Did anybody stick with you after you were finished? Yeah, yeah. I think I, I, we've talked a lot about how many different genres there are, subgenres. I mean, that's, I think that's, that's just such a good sign if there's that much variety within it. I think that's brilliant. Um, I still keep up with Meshuggah a bit and a bit of Black nice. Sabbath. But yeah, that's really cool. That's really cool. Uh, I guess I'll pose the same question to, to Isis and, and Jaden as well. Jaden, was, did, did any metal band stick with you after you finished? Yeah, I, I, I definitely still listen to um, a little bit of, Metallica, um, and you know, every once in a while, I'm like, I, you know, I, I need a little bit of energy, and I'm itching for some metal music. So I go back to my my Metal Lords playlist that I created back way back when. That's awesome. Isis, how about you? Yeah, I de Black Sabbath is definitely still on my radar, and yeah, I do sometimes have my Metal Lords playlist as well. I get that on, get it on shuffle. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Well, guys, thank you so much for taking time to chat today. I really appreciate it. Uh, Metal Lords is on uh, Netflix April 8th. Uh, thank you so much. Have a great rest of your day.